I'm too happy for the good news. <laughs> very soon. I'm prophesying. Very soon. Dean of students, lecturers, students, the press, ladies and gentlemen. I'm here this morning just to inaugurate the Students Entrepreneurship Initiative by the Ministry of Business Development. Before I go on with my official speech, um, I have some few words to share with you. The Ministry of Business Development was established by the President Nana Adodampa Akufuado to support businesses to grow and also to help the entrepreneurial ecosystem. We are of the view that to achieve Ghana beyond A, we must create more jobs and we must empower the private sector to employ more people. You'll be graduating very soon and you are going to the job market. And there's no job. The public sector is choked. What do we do? We have to empower the public, I mean the private enterprises to create more jobs and also empower you to, to create your own jobs to employ people. Um, you don't just finish school and go and sit in the house and be writing application for employment. No, that thing has passed. This time we want to empower you whilst you are in school. You can think through innovative ideas and have your own business. When you finish, you need to work for somebody who is employed. You can do your own business. And let me tell you some of the programs of the ministry. Okay, the Ministry of Business Development, uh, since it was created, has impact on uh, many projects. We have the Presidential Business Support Program. Uh, if you watch the TV, uh, television, uh, a few days ago, the president commenced disbursement of funds. This program. We support entrepreneurs, young entrepreneurs with funding to create their own businesses or to even expand their existing business. And uh, last year, about 7,000 people applied across the country. Normally, we don't receive a lot of applications from the north. But let me hasten to add that uh, those that we supported in last year, about 1,350 people, um, it's a government money and you must pay back. And I can tell you that the North has been very disciplined in paying back. When you compare the northern part of the country to the southern part, anytime you give money, Mr. Chairman, anytime you give money to people in the North to work, they work and work hard and pay back. And uh, we are happy for this development. And for that reason, this year, we are supporting about 3,000 entrepreneurs after training, about 12,000 of them. And majority of them are coming from the North because of the example they've shown. So, the President, thank you. The President commenced the disbursement of funds, and very soon, we'll be disbursing funds, ranging from 10,000 Ghana cities to 100,000 Ghana cities to young entrepreneurs, and those who want to start their businesses, or those who have already have business and they want to expand, so that they can do well, create more jobs for the teaming on employed graduates we have in this country. We also have the presidential pitch, where you go and pitch your business before the president. The president will sit, just like our vice director is sitting in another lecture. You come stand before the president, tell the president your kind of business, the type of business, how you are going to create employment for your business, how you are going to make money. Then, few of you, about 10 people will be selected and be given money ranging from 10,000 to 100,000. Last year, we did the same thing, and this year it happened, it happened at the banquet hall where the president handed checks to this entrepreneur. So there's a lot of opportunities we are creating. Uh, you don't only sit at your corner and say, oh, I'm reading. I'm reading my, my call, that's all. No, you have to think outside the box. You have to be very innovative, and you have to think of creating your own business and employing others too. Because the job market has suddenly all is true. So this is the mandate of the Business Development Ministry and this morning, I'm here representing my business development minister, Dr. Alhaji Ibrahim Awa Mohammed, a very hardworking minister, and also my CEO, that's the CEO of the National Entrepreneurship and Innovation Program, NEIP. And we are the implementing agency of the Ministry of Business Development. Mr. Chairman, I'll now go on to my uh, official speech. And I'm speaking on behalf of my minister. Mr. Chairman, Dean of Students, lecturers, students, 
the press, ladies and gentlemen. We are here today to inaugurate an important initiative, initiative of the Ministry of Business Development, the Student Entrepreneurship Initiative, SEI. The SEI is a deliberate effort by government to create an entrepreneurial ecosystem that engenders job creation and improvement in livelihoods. We are convinced that if young people are introduced to thinking about business concepts uh, concept and the right management structure to do business, their ideas can be honed and executed while they are at the tertiary level. The tendency that these student entrepreneurs will leave the university and other tertiary institutions with a high sense of business awareness and confidence would help in the large measure to increase the rate of business formation in the country. The Student Entrepreneurship Initiative has therefore designed a roadmap to inject heavy dose of entrepreneurship into to, indo, uh, to inject heavy dose of entrepreneurship into the schools as a panacea to graduate unemployment and the infant steps towards Ghana beyond age agenda. Every school is encouraged to form an entrepreneurial or business club with an active collaboration of the Ministry of Education, Management of the School, and the Ghana Education Service. The entrepreneurial clubs will be trained by selected hubs that will be created in the campus and also outside the campus with an active collaboration of the Ministry of Education and Ghana Education Service. The Ministry of Business Development and the National Entrepreneurship and Innovation Program is committed to this cause and will entreat all of you to be serious with this program. To generate excitement among tertiary institutions, SEI will enroll out business plan competition detailing what businesses the entrepreneurial clubs will want to pursue. Working on the business plans will foster sharing of ideas research funding, and finally, project execution. These are necessary condiments for success of business and will become the opening handbook of management to the students entrepreneurs. The grand final of the business plan competition will be held in Accra early next year, where students of the various tertiary institutions will present their ideas to a special jury. Winners of the business plan competition will then be moved around the world to experience the audacity of entrepreneurship and to understand the real world of business. This will constitute a world series of visiting places like the Silicon Valley in the, universe, in the United States of America and the tech city in London. Under the SER, the Ministry of Business Development will want to train and stimulate at least 10,000 students annually to think entrepreneurship and affect 2 million students over the next five years. Two, we'll bring the concept of entrepreneurship directly into the tertiary institutions set up by putting premium on topic as well as the training of students by any IP partner hubs. Third, benchmark the, asp the aspirants of the student entrepreneurship which would be successful companies by exposing them to the good and great world act of necessary acceleration for their dreams of establishing businesses. The fourth, the ministry will also track student entrepreneurship as a basis for research over the next 10 years to their growth in an attempt to, uh, in an attempt to mainstream the paradigm of teaching entrepreneurship at a tertiary level and even lower. The fifth is to change the narrative from graduate unemployment to graduate job creators as an index in the employment sector within five years. I encourage the students to take advantage of the Students' Entrepreneurship Initiative to come up with business ideas and be assured that government will support you to realize your dreams of becoming a successful entrepreneur. With these remarks, I am happy to declare the Students' Entrepreneurship Campus Business Page and the Students' Entrepreneurship Club of the Bogatanga Technical University duly inaugurated. Thank you. All right, we can do better than that. We can do better than that. We can do better than that.